everybody, welcome to my channel. I'm Zoe. And I'm Susie. And today we're going to be giving her bright pink hair. Intro. Her hair. So today we are going to be using Arctic Fox's Virgin Pink and Electric Paradise as a mixture to dye my mom's hair brilliant pink. <laughs> I love Arctic Fox dyes, I've used them lots in the past. If you want to see what virgin pink looks like on my brown hair, you can click a link right up here, I'll also leave the link down in the description if you want to see that. But today, we will be dyeing grey hair. And I've never dyed grey hair before. Have you, Mom? Not this grey. No. <laughs> so neither of us know what we're doing, neither of us are professionals, but we're going to have fun. First we'll tell you why I like Arctic Fox dyes and hand it over to my mom. Arctic Fox is a company based in California that is 100% cruelty free and donates 15% of their profits to help prevent animal abuse. Arctic Fox semi-permanent hair dyes are vegan, long lasting, free of harsh chemicals and condition while you color. So my mom's hair is naturally a level 6, 7, dark ash blonde, but mixed with the gray, it's actually a little bit lighter. So I think this is going to turn out really well. So all we've done is we've washed her hair using regular shampoo and allowed it to dry. And now we're going to use the colors as conditioner. This is half and half, and what? should we make it more magenta? Because this is going to come out bubblegum, I'm sure. Do you want more magenta or more bubblegum? Um, um, um. All right, we're going to add a little bit more virgin pink. I forgot to put gloves on. Oh my gosh. Don't forget to put gloves on. Oh, no, I got dropped. Oh no, this is a great start. This is a good start. Starting strong. <laughs> Gloves on first. All right, so this is the color we're starting off with. A little bit deeper than bubblegum pink. are back. Um, so last night I started to feel really sick and now I'm really sick. So welcome to my couch. <laughs> All right, I'm just going to pause it right here and explain things real quick. I've always wanted to do that. <laughs> so we filmed this about three weeks ago and in this footage I am sick. Uh, no, it's not what you think and yes, we are all fine now, but I did look absolutely terrible. So here's a better photo from the same day. Just imagine this while I'm talking. All right, uh, my mom also told me that if she was to be on camera without makeup, she would be wearing sunglasses. I love you, mom. Thank you so much for doing this and letting me dye your hair brilliant pink. Um, so this is the color 
It came out to be like a bright magenta. We left the color on for about five hours, so it definitely had time to uh, soak in. Yeah, look at that. I thought it was going to be more of like a bubblegum color, but it's almost purple. It's quite purple. I, why I think that happened was because the virgin pink is such a pigmented color, and it is a very purple pink. So I think that just kind of took over from the electric paradise. If you're wondering why my hair is a different color, that's because we also dyed that yesterday. So stay tuned for a future video. So the color, I will show you it the before and afters in indoor lighting. And then the before and after in outdoor lighting. So I'm not going to have color updates in this video, but I will leave a comment down below when I do get a color update, if you're looking for that. Price, shipping, and final thoughts. Well, Mom, what did you think about the hair dye? I love it. I love the way it makes my hair feel, and it's obviously a good color too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it makes my hair super shiny, I find, every time I use it. And it also smells like Swedish berries. <laughs> yeah. which, is, which is great. The smell actually lasts as well through a few washes. The 8 ounce bottles that we used today retail for about $16.99 American, actually exactly $16.99 US, and that works out to be about $22 Canadian. Um, if you order online, you obviously will pay shipping. It will be different depending on where you are and how much you buy, but me shipping from Florida all the way to Ontario, Canada, I've never paid more than $15 in shipping and I've never had to pay customs. Thank you so much for watching and sticking around to the end of the video. If you enjoyed yourself, please be sure and let us know. If you're looking for more, you can follow me on Instagram, at Anorthodol. You can subscribe to this channel by clicking here, or watch another video by clicking over here.